All right, let us do this. That is actually a pretty nice start. Um. Okay, so let's get you and you. And boom, boom, boom. That's actually a pretty solid start. Double DPS, we already got a combination going off with our spike shield situation. And then we also got the piggy as well for economy. Um, not, not, not bad, actually. We might lose this one though, due to just stamina and the, the pan is just stronger. So, unfortunate, but we still got ourselves a pretty solid start. I am going to go ahead and pick up this whetstone situation, increase our DPS just a little bit more. Um, and I'm going to pick this up so I can get myself a torch. I do want big space here, so I'm going to roll again. Got this big space and it's on sale. That's great. Let's pick you up. And I'm also going to pick up the pocket sand just to pick up the pocket sand, um, which I think is awesome. I could have made this situation a little bit better, um, but it's okay. Just to put the piggy bank on the wet zone, but it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Going against this guy, which is definitely stronger than us, probably due to uh, maybe he crit or something. I wasn't really paying it that much attention, but... I'm betting it on with crit. He had double clover. He's also had the whetstones and, and everything. So unfortunate, but yeah, let's get another whetstone. I'm not going to combine that into a hero sword just yet. And I will get myself a, another pig for that money. I do kind of want a leather armor, but we don't have the space, nor do we have the money for it. So I'm going to pass on it. Um, get the leather bag next round. Okay. And we'll just roll with this. We got the same amount of DPS, except I have the spike show he doesn't. On the other side, he does have healing, and we kind of just don't. Um, but I guess that was that uh, we kind of just didn't need it. <laughs> kind of rip shot blade this early. This early is insane. This early is actually insane. Let's um, I do want that rip shot blade. Yeah, I do want the rip shot blade. Let's get space. And we're also hey Dodd, how's it going? I don't know why Goober is meta. Goober is always meta, bro. Always. I'm gonna get the Goober. Speaking of the Goober, I'm gonna get the Goober. And I'm gonna get the space. And um And yeah, I guess we'll just have like two different forms of activation because we really don't have any food or anything like that. So we'll just rock with something that looks a little bit like that. I think that'll be decent. Um, and then we'll go boom, boom, boom. That way they both have two. Got our DPS, got our, you know, we got healing now, which is great. That'd be good. I do want to turn that into a, um, into, uh, what do you call that goober? I forgot the name of that goober, but we're turning into one of those. This guy is draining our stamina like crazy, which is extremely unfortunate. Hopefully we can still win with just us having spikes and maybe our healing from our goober. Um, but him having that shoot of Valor really hurt us. But we still won, which is good. So now we can get our still goo. We're just gonna go ahead and buy this. Honestly, I could just replace the torch with the ripshaw blade. I got space for it, so that's what we'll probably do. And then they give me a hungry blade right after that, which is nasty. It's a nasty thing to do to me. How dare you? Um. Um. No, nah, I can't. Okay, so yeah, I'm keeping ripshaw blade. I'm gonna pass on hungry blade. This will be my first time actually choosing the ripshaw blade over the hungry blade. So we'll see how this goes. Definitely have to see how this goes. Um, I'm gonna make this into a torch, a flaming torch or a, a mana torch. So we're gonna pop off this half potion. Um, I'm going ahead and sell the pocket sand just so I can pick up this third piggy, which is good for me. And we'll roll with that. Okay. Roll with this, see how this goes. Double broom, that's gonna be a big strain on our accuracy, unfortunately. Um, he's also got double banana, so his stamina is going to be pretty good. He's also got spike shields, just like us. So we're pretty even on that. The only difference probably is just us having Goober being able to heal, which is, yeah. Yeah, if we were able to heal like one more time there, that'd be great. Um, but yeah, now we got the still Goober. Let's get space. Let's, 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 let's roll on that. Um, getting a cap is kind of nice, actually. Very nice, actually. Um... I wish I had more activations. I would definitely like to use this still Goober as a form of DPS increase, potentially. Potentially, but it's at the same time. Well, maybe not. I mean, the Ripshot Blade is eight to 10. This is only a two to three. This early, we might be okay with uh, not having that increase in DPS since we just got an increase in DPS from the Ripshot Blade. So I'm gonna pick up this cap, roll. Got a blueberry. I'll take the blueberry for activation. Um, and I'm gonna take the fanny pack as well, just cause it's on sale. 
Oh, they also got a ripshaw blade. And they also got the bone arrow with it, too. That is extremely unfortunate. Um, yeah. <laughs> that just sucks for us. Dang. We gotta stop losing, man. Okay. Um, Spy you, you. I'm also gonna buy a ruby egg. Because it's on sale. I'm gonna roll. Uh... Can't block range attack exactly. That sucks your shield, yeah. Goober can help. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's so very true. I mean, at least we got the mana orb. We might as well pick up the banana that's on sale, right? Maybe even sell some of the piggies in order to get some space as well. Might not be that bad of a choice. Um. Let's see, I'm gonna do that and put the blueberry there so now we got three forms of activation um and then so we'll just do this hmm Let's see Let's sell this pig sell pig and Buy that and sell this pig and buy the banana. I don't know if I'm going to regret this or not. <laughs> I missed my piggies already, but now we have full on activations. Um, and then we have DPS increase from the ripshaw blade. We're going to get the mana torch. We already got ourselves a mana orb, which is good. This guy doesn't seem very strong, so I think we beat this guy. Hey, Blaze, how's it going? That mana orb would be great. Yeah, yeah. 100%. The only thing that's bugging us down now is stamina. So if I could run into a flute or something like that, that would be great. That would be great. Yeah. Boom. Now we have you. Um, My question is, which one of these do we get? I say we probably just get the leaf. Maybe. Maybe. Or piercing arrow. Leaf or piercing arrow. Leaf or piercing arrow. Leaf or piercing arrow. Oh. I'm going to go with the leaf. Go with the leaf. I might regret going with the leaf, but I'm gonna go with the leaf. Let's get the fanny pack roll. Getting that is nice, actually. And it's on sale, which is good. So yeah, okay, so let's see here. I don't really have much for the leaf to go on. Which is okay, I suppose. And I'm just gonna make this faster. And then this can go anywhere. We're not using it right now, so it really doesn't matter where it goes. So yeah, and our uh, ruby eggs about the proc too, which is that's good. That'll that's gonna increase our DPS, but we're gonna get some poison bill right now, so we might lose this. Because poison bills are dangerous. They are very dangerous. Oh, we won! Wow, we won because of double crit in a roll right there. I think it was great. So now we got this, which is awesome. I'm actually going to switch the situation up just a tad um, and put the ripshot blade there instead. Um, Actually, wait. Okay, maybe not wait. Let me see something. Boom. Yeah, okay. So that can go like that. That can go like that. Boom. Ripshaw Blade can go there. And that way, when we're out of stamina, because we're going to be out of stamina, unless we fix this stamina issue, which we need to. But for now, since we're just going to be out of stamina, the Ruby well, can still attack and deal damage. And it's getting double DPS increase, which is good. Very good. With that being said, we probably should put the crit on the ruby well, uh, ruby well as well. So that would probably be smart. Then I'm gonna do that. And honestly, I would like this to go here instead. Um, which, you know what, I can actually. I can just move this like so and do that and boom. That way we have double activation on that, which is all you need. For the magic torch you don't need more than that as long as you have one you know what i mean one of mana you're straight um yeah this is looking not too bad honestly got a crit got our activations okay let's get a stone for the sake of having stone might even be able to use that on that and i do want the leather armor also means i need more space should of is good too another blueberry is also good i'll buy both of these just because it's the most immediate space that I see, for the most part. You know, I got next round with Dragon. Good like that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 100%. It's going to be great. 
I might as well make the ruby ball faster too, huh? And then double fanny. I don't think that's a bad choice. Blueberry can actually go right there since it's faster. More activations. Um, you know what? I'm just going to move this up by one. And uh, move that. Right. That works for me. There we go. That looks good. Wish I could put that right there. Technically, I could, but I don't think it'd be a good choice. Do that. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. So far, so good, though. Decently good. Um, we're probably going to beat this guy. He has North Orange Generation. He's got Poison Ivy. All he has is a Torch. As for DPS. So, yeah. <laughs> Definitely more than likely 100% beating that guy good game though good game let's sell um let's sell the spike shoe so we can get you shield of a lore i'm also just gonna buy that just put it at the end there and you know what you know what i'm gonna uh, i'm gonna turn this into a moon shoe that's what i'm gonna turn it into a moon shoe let's get turned into the moon shoe how do you beatbox backwards? I've never heard of that question before. I don't think that's possible. You just need more regeneration and stamina. I need more stamina for sure. I've been hoping to get us flute because in the flute, Jesus freaking Christ. In the flute we trust. I'm so glad that gray sword didn't crit at the end there. I think we would actually die. But yeah, in the flute we trust. Oh crap, I almost rolled. <laughs> in the flute we trust. Almost rolled, almost lost my flute. At least that'll give me more gen uh, region. Um, not region. More stamina. Only issue now is space for this leather armor. Not really sure where I can put you. TBH. I would like to put it somewhere up here. That means I have to move the flute somewhere. You can go there. Let's see. I can figure this out. Maybe I shouldn't. Well, maybe I should. I don't know. Maybe I should. Because I still want to have an activation on the still goober. So maybe putting it like that is better. Even though it's not right next to the moon shield, that's a little... No, 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 no. I'm just going to do it like that. Just for an activation on the moon shield, I feel like it makes it somewhat worth to do it like that. Man, we need space. Our space management is bad. I don't know which one it is. It's one of them. One of them is happening right now. You know what? No, 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 no. I'm just gonna do it like that. And keep that activation. Oh, the flute generates armor. I forgot about the flute generating armor. Okay, that worked. I don't know how I forgot about the flute generating armor. That kind of just works then. Cool. And I'm just gonna put all this in the most random of areas. And we're rolling with that. Okay. Hell yeah. A dark saber? Okay. What debuffs are you putting on me? I guess the blind is a debuff that he's putting on me. At least we have the flute to give me clovers to combat blind for the most part, because if it wasn't for that, I'd, I'd be fucked. Honestly, that in the mana torch having 200% accuracy is also good. Um, but yeah, he's not really putting any debuffs on me. <laughs> not really sure why he went with a dark saber combined with the leaf. And he's not really using mana for anything. Interesting. He's got an interesting dude. I'll say that he's a interesting dude. <laughs> good game. Um. Let's roll on that. Rolling again? I'll get this face rolling again. Another flute is good. Rolling again? Blueberry? Blueberry and acorn collar would be nice. Acorn collar would be more nice than anything, though. I'm just going to put that right there. I figure it being on two things versus one is just better. Um, and then second flute, uh, haha, -ha, don't know where to put you. I should probably, what does that look like? Shit. 
what it looks like. Uh, <laughs> I'm just gonna put the flute down here. I, I would just like to prefer the flute to be connected to the shield somehow. That's the only reason. Just because of that 12 uh, armor or 14 armor um, can be used for more mana. Why do you need more mana? I don't know. And it gives 30% more armor. I don't know why I need more mana. I don't know. I'm selling you. Well, yeah, I, I don't know, but I want it. So I want more mana. Now we're out of space. We're so out of space. Disgustingly out of space right now. But, you know, we, you know, we saw our stamina issue a little bit. Double fluidage, you know what I mean? Never a bad thing. Going against a poison build with double gooby. I don't know why you're going double gooby, but they're going double gooby. Congratulations on dubbing, going double gooby. I hope it was great. I do want that mana orb. And we might as well pick up the space. And the clover. And now we're broke. So, um, I'm going to put you there. And then the clovers can just go there. Actually, no, we can like... Hell yeah. It's not just better. I'm waiting for a vampiric armor. That's what I really want right now is a nice juicy vampiric armor. And if I can get the 30 mana in order to proc that mana orb, that would be nice. So hopefully that can happen too. Um, looks like we're going against a mana torch hungry blade build. On the bright side. No, that's not a bloodthorn. It's just a hungry blade. And we don't remove. We do remove regeneration. Yeah. What am I doing? Dang, I'm tripping. At least we removed some of his regeneration. Now he's not able to use it because he's out of stamina. Which is great. Absolutely amazing. And then the hours just keeps building and building and building. And uh, now he's dead. Good game. Hey, there we go. There's my vampire armor that I love so much. Um, And uh, some... Oh, well, did give me space, but I kind of can't buy it. So... Yeah. Uh, so just do that. Works for me. And then another blueberry for crit. And more space. Boom. Boom. Oh, wow. This is my first time seeing a legitimate triple. Triple. What do you call you again? Claws of attack. Triple claws of attack build on poison. It's really cool to see, actually. Unfortunately, I have Ripshaw Blade, and that kind of destroys your entire build because your Claws of Attack can't get faster, which means you don't gain your empowerment faster, which also means you're fucked. I'm sorry. So, but someone had to do it. <laughs> someone had to do it. When I see that, it looks like a baby Bloodthorn. A baby Bloodthorn build. All right, now we can switch that because I think that's better. Space. Roll. Get more space. Ooh. Don't want to do that. Stop it. More space could be cool. Um, could be cool. Sorry, not sorry. Exactly. Precisely precise. Let's move you like that. I, I just think that's better. Um, and we can move you down by one. Now to organize this space a little bit better somehow. Why did I get this mini potion belt? Who told me to do this? Alright, okay, that works. And the last one can go right there. Now you go there. You go there. <laughs> Just love how it's just only two stars. It's great. But at least you give me armor and mana and um, you give me everything I, I would want in this build, so. And you give me three activations on my mana orb. You're doing great. I guess I just, uh, loot. Well, no. Kind of. No. Hmm. I'm a. Hmm. That nice. I'm gonna buy this. I can figure this out. I can figure this out. <laughs> My water. Eating me a frog. Now I'm dead. Thank you for the follow tree bear. I appreciate it. Bird. Beard. Beard. Why'd I say bear? <laughs> tree bear. 
tree beard. I appreciate that, bro. Thank you. Those are some sad flutes they are. But at least they're friends. You know what I mean? At least they got, you know, they're together in the sadness. That makes it less sad. You know, struggling together makes everything better. You know what I mean? You understand. You get it. You get it. Boom! Look at that. <laughs> that was great, wasn't it? All right. This is great. This is great. Everything's working according to... That is a double Belladonna's Whisperer. Oh my god. With no thorns. With no thorns. Interesting. Let's see how I do against this. But hey, look at my double flutage. They're going, they're, they're kind of going crazy right now, no? Even though we're about to be out of stamina. But my orb is about to proc, which is great. And the game's over. Good game. And we'll put you right there. Or, uh, hmm. Yeah, I guess right there was the, the right answer. Um, roll, have a blueberry to activate the goober in Ripshaw to get buffed by it. Have a blueberry to activate the goober in Ripshaw to get buffed by it. I don't know what that means. What does that mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean have a goober, have a blueberry activate the goober? But... Aren't these better? Aren't these all? Aren't all these activators better? Versus the blueberry for the activation? Doesn't the goober give damage? Yeah, it's giving damage to the ruby well right now. Unless you're saying use two different weapons that to give it damage. So it, it would give damage. So you're saying use the magic torch and put it under the goober, and then just use the blueberry for another activation, basically, right? Hold that thought. I want to test something real quick. <laughs> I understand you though, but hold that thought. I want to see how fast these flutes are and see if they end up being faster. Probably not, but see if they end up being faster than the blueberry or not. I doubt it, but maybe. It'd be kind of cool, at least if they were. Um, I guess I'll buy you. Give me a cap of discomfort and more gloves. Okay, do you think that's better though? Okay. That, yeah, probably right. That probably is better. Getting an increase in DPS on one of the weapons and just using the blueberries as an activator instead. Are we going to beat the dragon? A life stealing dragon? With a torch and another dragon and another torch. I have two torches. <laughs> I think we will. We generate a lot of blog, by the way. Come on, we can do this. It's got 25 heat, bro. Oh my gosh. There we go. I, if that battle went on longer, he definitely outscales us. Can I see how much block we generate? We can, right? Block. Damn. Generate 208 block from that. 168 from the still goober. The flute doesn't generate anything, bro. What is that <laughs> compared to the other sources of block? That's insane. They should add something for stamina here to see how much stamina you gain or generate. That'd be kind of cool. That'd be dope, actually. What about mana? From the moon. Sh well, wait. Yeah. From the moon shield. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's pretty cool, though. All right, and this was 3.8 seconds. That's actually not bad. It was five seconds, and this only got four stars. This one's only got two. I wonder how fast like a full-blown flute is. That's I was expecting like four seconds or something. I wasn't expecting it to be that fast. Okay, but let's um rearrange everything, right? So. Um, we're gonna put the still goober there. We're gonna rotate you back. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I lied. I lied. We're gonna put it right there. All right, still goober goes there. Um, we'll go double fanny pack, right? And we'll put the magic torch right under that bad boy. Make sure that it's inside of the crit thing. Um, and right next to it, I guess we can do the whelpage. 
the good old well pitch. And then um, this guy can just go right there. So we'll go boom, boom. Unfortunately, it won't be inside of the critting, but that's fine. Mainly using it for utility more than anything. I think the Ruru Up does the most amount of damage. If stamina is an issue. If stamina is not an issue, then it's probably going to be Torch, I think. I think. Um, as far as the other activators go, that might be an issue. Slight issue. We can go Torch. We can go Flute. And Shield. Uh, and then here can be the armor. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, I don't know. Um, double flute activation. Where's the stars on this flute? Oh, no. <laughs> I knew that. I knew that. Boom, 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 and we got space left over. That's not bad. Act I, I mean, uh, it might be, it might be too bad, I guess. If these are faster than three seconds at the end of the day, they do have more stars instead of four. It's five, which is better than not having it. You know, any, I guess. Um, you know what I mean? Just turn the crit bag. I am late on that. I'm sorry. <laughs> Very sorry. I'm pretty sure you done said something or I done changed it or something. I should get a birdie. That one right there. Do I want to like that? Probably like that. Uh, this can go there. You can go here. And then the rest is just stuff, I suppose, that goes places. turn you can get the rip shot in there actually you're right <laughs> I, I, my brain i have to think about it for a second i envisioned it but yeah you're right okay i'll turn it after this on the bright side we wouldn't get us a blood thrown <laughs> so there's that good game okay so you're saying do that right and then i'll have this up there instead like this uh so like that Right, and then Bloodthorn, uh, not Bloodthorn, but Ripshot can go there, that can go there, Magic Torch goes there, that way they're all three inside of the pack. Boom! That works. I didn't think about that. Good looks, good looks, good looks. Um, was I out of stamina there? I wasn't looking. If I need you, this is the last round, I do not need you. I want this. We're just gonna put it there. I already got two of them, or three of them. So I don't think I'm really stressing for stamina. To be fair. All right, I guess that's that. <laughs> Can't really buy anything else. Um, yeah. That's game. That's game. What am I going against? Huh. Ooh, Jesus. Wait, why? Question mark? Why? Why not on something that makes sense? Like, uh, you know, the Bloodthorn or the Ripshaw Blade? You hit why on the dagger? I mean, you have three stamina potions. You would have been fine on stamina if you just sped up your Bloodthorn and Ripshaw Blade. Why do you have th four? Th 
tired of questioning these people. It's okay, Kume. You know, it's a great build. It's a great build. Imagine I lose. <laughs> that would be so fun. Oh, but I don't. <laughs> Good game. I think minimizing your builds with items positioning is definitely your weak side. Minimaxing. Yeah, you're right. And, you know, I, I just don't be taking out the time to like look at it and be like, oh, yeah. I just like go 